Hey folks, your OS review is you're watching our video review of the Reed 2.4G wireless optical mouse, an inexpensive sub $20 optical mouse you can pick up on Amazon or through Reed's website. This is a fairly stylish looking mouse, which we'll see, show you in a moment. It comes in several color schemes that you can customize with. It also has a working distance of roughly 10 meters, which is pretty good for desktops and laptops alike. It's a simple plug and play connection with no real CD drivers needed and works with both Windows computers and Mac computers. It also has a nano receiver, which is the USB tip. It's very small. It's not going to take up too, too much space on your desktop or on your laptop computer. Taking a look at the packaging, pretty simple. It's crafted out of cardboard. Our review unit receive, uh, was received within three days, so pretty fast shipping. And you have just a mouse itself, in addition to an instruction manual and the styling of Reese wireless mouse is obviously inspired by some gaming mouses out there. It's elegant and it looks fairly classy and high end. It looks almost futuristic with its blue accents on the sides. It's crafted out of a soft touch rubber material, which is resistant to any scratches and also to fingerprints, which is nice. But there are a few downsides to these devices' design. For example, the sharp corners on the top can actually hurt you a little bit if you run your fingers on the sides too much. And also the scroll wheel in the scroll wheel in the center there is a little bit resistant to your movement, so you do need to press a little bit harder than you're used to on traditional mouses. With that being said, we're definitely fans of the overall aesthetic and the look, and the left and right cl click keys are very sensitive and easy to press. They're tactile and responsive, and there's also a few programmable keys along the sides that are the shoulder keys that you can actually set for different games and other, other applications. Turning the mouse over, you have access to just the optical sensor on the very back, and there's also the micro receiver, which you can plug out uh, for storage options or put a back in when you're traveling, uh, and plug in this optical mouse connected to a tablet representing a Windows 7 computer or a laptop, and you can see how the experience is pretty smooth and lucid. There's not too much lag at all, so I can easily drag around, and it seems to be working fine. I can press on the icons, it's very sensitive, and the scroll wheel and everything like that works nicely as well. I can also press on small links, and it's rather responsive and easy to use. Let's press on the paint application there to give you a quick uh, look at how it actually works when you're dragging the mouse around. It seems pretty smooth and lucid, and it depends on the surface of your uh, desktop and also your table as well. It works better on a matte surface, but you, if you have a transflective surface, like on glass or something, you do need to have a matte in place before you use the optical mouse, or else the uh, connection is going to seem a little bit more finicky. The range for this optical mouse is also pretty strong. I could get it, uh, if, if I had a desktop, I could plug in the uh, adapter onto the desktop and then use the mouse on my table a few meters away and it still should work just fine and I didn't really have any issues with terms of the speed or the connection either. So the support is good, it automatically adjusted and installed the drivers when I plugged in the USB dongle and it was pretty fast so the recognition is strong even with Mac and Windows PCs and tablets in general so pretty good performance from this unit. Overall, we're fans of the Re Optical Mouse. We think that it's built nicely, it functions correctly, and it's great for both Windows as well as Mac computers and laptops. The driver is very quick to install, and the overall style of the mouse is definitely on point. The price is also very, very compelling. To check out more details about this unit, be sure to read our full review on our website, but this has been our video review. Thanks for watching, here at OS Reviews.